Welcome back, everyone. So if you missed the news last night, here are a few stories we brought to you at 9 p.m. Let's start with this for just a moment. Police in southwest Houston looking for the person they say opened fire at a sonic drive through off of the South Post Oak Road. A woman was actually killed in a car Sunday afternoon. Police say there was some sort of fight between two men in the vehicle when one of them opened fire, hitting the woman who was in the passenger seat. Police are now talking to witnesses, but so far have not released any details on a current suspect. A shooting suspect allegedly led police on a high speed chase and three children were also in the car. Police say this man, Jamarcus Coleman, matched the description of the person who shot a man at an apartment complex in Galveston. Officers tried to pull him over, but he fled to Lamarck. That's where he was arrested. The children were not hurt and were released to a family member. The shooting victim is in critical condition. Coleman is now charged with assault, evading arrest and endangering a child. A day after pausing the shipment of toxic runoff to southeast Texas from that train disaster in Ohio, the EPA now says shipments can start up once again today. Right now, it doesn't appear that the wastewater is coming here to southeast Texas, at least not right away. Starting today, the EPA says solid and liquid waste will go to two facilities in Ohio, and the agency will continue to look for other disposal locations.